What's going on, you guys? This is Bob Bat at Hell24 here. We're back with another reaction video. We're doing some more analog horror spooky stuff. This is from a new person by the number 12 man. We're watching some FNAF VHS tapes. Yeah, I'm finally doing it. Finally getting on that FNAF VHS tape train here. Uh, this one's called Medical Imaging. Which is very interesting, a very interesting game, and I'm very intrigued to see what this is, so without further ado... <gasps> no introduction needed anymore. Bright and Clinic of Hope. I see. The Bright and Clinic of Hope. Radiology and Diagnostic Imaging. Alright. So we're in like a fucking medical hospital. Arise procedure. Tape serial number is 182. Okay. Okay. MRI. You have an MRI machine. People looking at, like, scans of something. What does it say? Me yes, and... What? Just call me Brit. Yeah. Especially employed and all. Yeah. However, I consider everyone as a friend here. Yeah. Everyone calls me by my name, and I don't want to put any unnecessary pressure on my staff. Okay. 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 Keep that in mind. But, yeah. Uh, So let me read this real bit quickly. The state was found in a trash bag near the bus station. Shows camcorder footage recorded by Dr. Londo Smokes, Brighton's Clinic of a Hope employee. The video shows an image CT scanning procedure conducted on a very sick seven year old patient. As far as I know, the footage was presumably given to the Food and Drug Administration, the Federal Bureau of Investigation. Very likely, this footage wasn't meant to be seen by the public, and we're doing something very illegal. Okay, that sets the tone of... Mark, you're not conducting any procedures right now. You'll strain your eyes badly by staring at these screens. Sets the tone of the video. I'm used to working in the dark anyways. The brightness of these screens isn't really much of an issue, so it's really okay. unlikely I'd do something in my eyes. So, okay. you wanted to have a little conversation with me? You called my office number two times, not even three minutes ago. Okay. I wanted to check if Brennan had passed you some urgent information about the recent CT scans we've conducted for the past two weeks. Uh... Okay. I don't know anything about it. Really? Richard didn't Really? No. Uh, of course he did tell you, otherwise we would be having this conversation. What, what kind of conversation? Is something going on in this department that I don't know? Grace, please. Probably. Let me explain. Wanted to tell you, but I was just too afraid of how you would react. Okay. Here it goes, I guess. For the past two weeks, this is all set up. Some pretty odd cases. Uh, my huh? whole job at St. Hanna Radiology Center, most of the time, if not always, I received and examined CT scans, brain abnormalities, skull traumas, and abdominal oddities. Huh. Most of the time, it was just internal bleeding cases, blood clots, phenomena, tuberculosis, and two cases of removable lung cancer tumors. Yeah. Children's poisoner. Uh, oh right. Uh, and when I started working here, my first few weeks were exactly the same as my old office. Okay, we're getting a good look at the computers. Can't read that. Probably important. Over the past two weeks, I've gotten these four cases, which, to be completely honest, scared a little bit shit out of me. Starting with Ricky Summers. Patient okay. information, seven years old, male. Seven. Severe abdominal pain, vomiting, fever, and muscular pain. And his symptoms have gotten much worse about a week after eating at Freddy Fazbear's Pizza. I, I guess you've heard of that restaurant. Yeah. Oh, shit. So these kids are getting poisoned at Freddy Fazbear's Pizza. Uh, I know that place. 
And then it's in this restaurant built as a response to Bond's Burgers with the same urban legends about disappearing people as spirits. Bond's Burgers? What about it? Do you think that child got sick right after eating in there? I'll get to that later. Bond's so, Burgers. If you're witnessing such symptoms, you'd probably just assume that okay. it was severe food poisoning or an extreme case of the flu. Yeah. Those are typical symptoms of a severe flu or complex food poisoning. For of, course, of course. Of course. Exactly. Of course. Of course. But every poisoning test, and even the viral blood test, showed negative results. And that was until I decided to give him a proper abdominal CT scan. Hmm. Take a look at this. Let's see. Let's see what the hell is going on here. What the fuck? Uh, please, what? Doctor, excuse my foul mouth, but Jesus, what the hell is this? What? That is cystic echinococcus. Cystic echinococcus? What? H how? In in this region? How'd that thing get so big? These little tape bastards tend to develop really fast and oh tapeworms when they do they finally show up most of the time it's just too late the balloon pops and the whole abdominal cavity gets infected oh and then you die yep i know yep i know that well, one uh congratulations on your accurate diagnosis then uh, i'm not finished yet Chris. i wouldn't call you a mr here in peace but it's just a single case of cystic catechosis but it's alarming seeing such a case itself another three times throughout the next two weeks. Every test showed the same symptoms, same images, pretty what? much the same diagnosis. Except for what? One, which we'll get to later at the end. See? Next There's one. Man, eight years old. Love man. So it's cases of the same thing. What the fuck? Then how? Foxes, badgers, or any wild animal for that matter. Then how? I and my fellow pediatrician, Dr. Goodman, initiated a little investigation and started asking the parents what the hell happened and what they suspect could have caused such an illness. And every single parent admitted that just before the incidents, they had all went to the same Freddy Fazbear's Pizzeria. Now the real question is, okay. how in the hell would they all catch the same illness? And especially for classic cheese pizzas, because we got their order bills in our hand to see what they had for dinner. Yeah, that's... Turns out, some sick fuck roams around there and adds God knows what shit into the pizzas with motherfucking tapeworm eggs in it. Why? Oh. Uh, what the fuck? The worst of all of these is the case of Sadie Preacher, who was six years old. Symptoms are unbearable headaches, vomiting, dizziness, and progressive yeah. I'm not ready for this CT scan. Let's see this dude. Oh my god. Oh my god. Turns out that lunatic not only had some spare hydated worm eggs, but poor tapeworm ones as well. Oh my god. Fucking god, dude. That's why I've decided to record this as footage. I bring it to the local police. My fucking god. I and Brendan have already collected all the necessary information. Hello? I've been looking for you for ages. Another urgency. Patient, age 70, from ER in less than two minutes. What's going on? Does anyone care to explain to me? We've got the fifth case of that poisoning thing. Bullshit. What? For god's sake. Okay. No shot. Great. You get to see with your own eyes what bizarre shit goes on here. You stay here and watch. My God. Okay. Hope it's not what I think it is. No shot. It's the same thing. Okay, just give me a moment. You hear him screaming. 
I'm here screaming. What the fuck is happening? Mission is ready. We can start the procedure. Okay, CT scan. Loading tube warming up. Let's see that CT scan. Let's see what it is, dude. Give me the same fucking tapeworm thing. Let's start with the head section. And we'll move slowly towards the abdomen. Being poisoned Mission by someone. Eric Carly, seven years old. Symptoms according to his mother are dizziness. Extreme abdominal pain, blood, and bile vomiting. Of course. Appetite, diarrhea, and loss of energy. Of course. Worse Got some shit going on his abdomen, I guess. Gallons of blood and bile in class today. Ew! Gallons of blood. Do an entire body scan. Let's see those tapeworms. Uh, fucking whatever the fuck. Luckily, your friend told me everything. Good. That's... that's good. Yeah, that's good. Let's see. Cool. Yeah, The brain seems to be intact. It does. Moving to the chest, out of the abdomen. Let's see it, dude. Let's see what there is! I am not ready for this one. I'm just watching. I'm just watching your wing in this situation here. I don't know what's happening here. Right, oh my move. god. Jesus. Can't see any cysts here, especially in the liver. Yeah? So that's regular poison, right? Yeah. I'm not too sure the images aren't sharp enough. Maybe. I'm manipulating the image with brightness and contrast. I would try that. See what there is going on here. Wait a minute. What? Something's off. What? Free scan. It moved. What? It moved. It's actually a full colony of damn liver flukes. No wonder this kid got a sudden bile vomiting attack. Yeah. These worms are literally eating his inside out. Yeah. Eating him with the inside out. It's perforated. Liver fluke must have chewed it up and made its way to the vascular tract. Oh shit. If the fluke reaches the heart, he dies. Eric will die. Yeah, he dies if that happens. What's going on? What? Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god, wait. Wait. What's happening? What's happening? It's getting faster and faster! It's getting faster and faster. Oh my god. Oh my god. It's on that same shot of the fucking thing. It looks like it breached. What the fuck is going on here? Stop standing like a moron and help me. What the fuck is going on? There's no time for this. Fuck yeah, I'm doing CPR. Alright, ready? Stand back. Clear! What the hell? What the hell? Oh 
Oh my god. What was that? Oh my god. Fucking dead? Oh my god. You just toggle off already, piece of junk. Oh. I don't feel good. Fuck this shit. Second kid this week. I don't feel good. I don't feel good at all. We'll hold that fucking psycho in the restaurant owner accountable for this. They'll both pay for what they fucking did. Yeah, I don't feel good at this. I don't feel good. Dude, fucking hell, dude. Keep my eyes off fucking tearing up. My eyes are fucking tearing up, dude. Oh my god. It's just the one shot. That one single shot caused all happening. God. Oh, fuck. Oh, that caught me off guard there. There was a face. What? You lick? What the hell? Whoa, what's happening? You killed? Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh. Oh. <coughs> 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 oh fuck. I can't even fucking speak. I can't even. That had to be one of the worst fucking things that I've ever seen. Oh my god. <coughs> Literally nothing has made me gag like cough like that before. Oh my god. Ugh. I had that was like that was a really really fucking wow. Wow, that was terrible. I never want to hear those screams ever again. I never want to hear those fucking screams ever again. Oh my god. Impossible if the children get poisoned. Yeah, all hygiene rules, but there was someone poisoning the fucking pizza. Sick my stomach. Uh. 
I feel sick to my fucking stomach here. The resident burned down William's house of his lynching. But the other shit called Williams really good from the escape to the state was called Texas, town was called Delaware. Provided identity, so I have to sentence there. Oh my god, what the fuck was that? That was the worst thing ever. That was the worst. Oh my god. Well, Paul Man did a good job of making this fucking unnerving. Oh. Oh. Eh. Yeah, I'm done. I'm done. I'm fucking done. Oh my god. Oh my god, that was fucking terrible. That was so bad. Oh my god. I don't know if you could hear me over that, but... Because I think my audio is too loud, but what the fuck? That's it for this reaction. If y'all want to watch more, subscribe, like, comment. What you guys want me to do next. And I will see all of you in the next video. Later.